poor guy. He goes through so much. Hey, yo, what's up, ladies and gentlemen? It's your boy, and welcome back to another video. <sighs> Today's special for multiple reasons, ladies and gentlemen. One, Jay's in the office, but we're, we're social distancing, so I'm gonna go off camera so you can say hi to Jay. <laughs> Did you miss me? Not if you keep doing that. Uh, they're gonna know. Okay. Hey, yo, what's up, ladies and gentlemen? It's... I keep taking your line. Okay, it's me. I'm back. Okay, come on, come okay. on. Go. I think that's what we have to do right now. It's also a special video because of this box right here, ladies and gentlemen. This is a very special box because it's got some Tesla products in it. It's kind of like a little Tesla mystery box vibe, except, well, I kind of know what's in it, but you guys don't necessarily know what's in it. But some very exclusive, limited release Tesla products are in this box, and your boy had to spend a pretty penny to get my hands on it because I couldn't get them retail because Elon doesn't sell them to us Canadians for some reason. I'm not entirely sure why. And of course they sell out really fast. So I had to buy them on the reseller market and I'm, I'm ashamed to admit how much I spent for them, but I'm gonna be holding on to these forever. So with that being said, let's pop this box open and see what we've got inside. Leave some comments down below if you have any ideas as to what it is. Yeah, yeah, you guys probably know. You know what at least one item is? We've got one box, a second box, and a third box. A lot of boxes inside a lot of boxes. Okay, I'm gonna put this one down here because that's the most important one. And of course, I'm gonna leave you on the edge of your seat and we're gonna open it. I don't know when, I don't know. But you can't skip forward in the video and find out because I'm not gonna tell you. The first item we have here, ladies and gentlemen, is a Tesla Model 3. What? I bet you you didn't know, you know, I already have one, but we're unboxing another one. This one is a die-cast Model 3. If you guys remember, we got a die-cast semi, Tesla semi. It's significantly larger. I've been waiting for my Tesla Cybertruck to come in, and I just wanted a new Tesla. And so I got this one. It's cheaper. So it comes in a custom Model 3 box. It's a 143rd sized Model 3 die. So basically, if you blew this up by 43 times, it would be the size of my actual Model 3. By the way, guys, we have 3D printed. We've printed a Tesla Cybertruck. We've 3D printed a Tesla Roadster. If you guys want to see me 3D print my Tesla Model 3, be sure to smash the like button or let me know what else you'd like to see us 3D print. Did you know that the Tesla Roadster, the original Tesla Roadster, Jay, is worth more than people paid for it now? Because there is such a limited amount of them. Maybe I'll buy one of those. It's only like 150 grand. Yeah. Okay, here it is, ladies and gentlemen, our very own. Does it stay in this case? I can't drive it around like a Hot Wheels? What? It's literally in its own case. Like you have to screw it to take it out. See all this? Yeah. Did you see this, folks? Should I open it? Yeah, open it. Oh God, this is a really bad idea. How do I get it? Oh, this was just connecting the car. Oh, oh my God. Okay, we got it. If you buy one of these, don't do this, okay? I think it's meant to stay inside, but all to find oh, out yeah. if the wheels move. <laughs> Yo, this is fire. Oh, this is actually mad smooth. This is the only driving I'll be doing once I have a sip of what we have later. <laughs> okay, well, that was cool. I'm gonna put this back in and never take it out again. Okay, cool. Well, uh, that'll be a nice little desk ornament in my office. Okay, so first and definitely the least exciting item, but don't worry, it's getting way cooler, okay? Next item. If you guys get 20,000 likes, Jay is going to actually do a modeling session with the next item I'm about to open. Boom, the Tesla short shorts. Come on, look at this box. It's black and gold like the New Orleans Saints. Oh my God. The Tesla short shorts, they're legit <laughs> short shorts. You know how much these sold for? $69.420, wait, what? 420 cents. Wait, where is that? I don't know if that's a rumor, if that's real. It makes sense. Elon loves 69420, it's a thing. <laughs> Anyways, by the way, guys, I don't know if you're aware, but we do also have a channel called the Tesla Space, where if you're into getting more information about Tesla, Elon Musk, SpaceX, all the different things Elon's up to, be sure to check it out. Link is down below in the description. If you're not into it, don't check it out, okay? You don't have to do it. I don't want you to go sub and then never watch the videos. Only sub and watch the videos if you're gonna watch the videos, okay? But yeah, I just wanna let you guys know, be sure to check it out. But back to what we have in front of us, the Tesla short shorts. Now, I don't know if, if you or you at home know the story behind these. Of all the things that Tesla could release, why short shorts? Do you know the answer? Do you know the answer? Well, the reason is, 
is he's a troll. I mean, that's pretty obvious, but this was specifically to troll all the investors who shorted Tesla stocks. You guys aren't familiar with shorting. It's basically when you bet against the stock going up. So he released these as an exclusive troll to just rub it in their faces. And of course, that's something Elon would do, but what's he gonna do next? I'm thinking maybe Tesla weed because he's gonna smoke the competition. It's legal, I don't know. Okay, but seriously, this box is insane. So look at this on the back, okay? This is a statement about Elon Musk. I'm obviously talking a lot. We, I know you wanna get to short shorts open. You wanna see Jay wearing them. I get it, okay, we'll get there in a second. What? But it says Tesla short shorts made on earth by humans. Elon's on another level. You know, not made in China, not made in North America, not made in the United States, nah. Made on earth by humans because obviously Elon's got SpaceX. They're yeah. planning to go to Mars in the next, you know, three to four years. You guys wanna learn more about that? Check out the Tesla space. We did a video on it, but come on. That's a flex, interstellar flex. Okay, anyways, let's pop these bad boys open and see what the short shorts are all about. Tell me this isn't like a Louis Vuitton <laughs> designer box and everything. <laughs> He loves the goat. Oh my god. Bam! Oh, not bad, eh? I might be able to wear these without things yeah. popping up. Uh, we got on the back though, S3XY. If you guys don't know the Model S, the Model 3, the Model X, the Model Y, it's spelled sexy. I don't know exactly what's going on with Elon, but I think he like missed out on his college days and that's why he does the 69420 and the sexy thing all the time. Feels like a college kid in a frat, but come on, look at these things. They're actually kind of fire. Yeah, you gotta wear your briefs nice and tight if you're wearing anything underneath. <laughs> Otherwise, the family picnic might get a little uh, not PG. They kind of give me like a boxing short feel though. Muhammad Ali might have rocked these back in the day when he was floating like a butterfly, stinging like a bee. Imagine Tesla sponsored a boxer. <laughs> okay, anyways, as we mentioned, Jay. Nah, nah, nah. Am I gonna have to try them on? That's not gonna hold anything. They're extra large. Yeah, yeah, I could wear these. Yeah, you got booty. I do not have booty. Okay, fine, I'll, I'll put them on for like two seconds. That's it. That's all you get. That's all you get. If you want more, onlyfans.com slash it's your boy. I'm just kidding. I don't, I'm not doing that. It's time for the piece de resistance. Now, I'm kind of stressed because this box is open. I don't know if we're actually going to get what we expect in here. But it does say this package contains alcohol. Recipient must be at least 21 years old. Do not deliver to an intoxicated person. <laughs> It actually says that. So what, like you show up at the door, I've had a few beers, I can't get my bottle? Like what? I'm trying to polish myself off. Well, I think you all know what's inside here. Let's take a look. I think outside of the Boring Company flamethrower, this is the one item that I was most down to get. I am going to hold on to this for the rest of my life. I don't give a shit. I'm never selling this. And if you want to give me a million dollars, I will definitely sell it to you. Guys, please just smash the like button because not only did I do this for myself, mostly for myself because I really wanted this, but also for you guys because I know you wanted to see me unbox it. Okay, here we go. Oh. The only thing that's missing so far, there's no peels. Elon, come on, you know your boy likes the peels. Apple does the peel real good for me. I need a peel. This doesn't, it just doesn't cut it for me, okay? Oh, okay. Oh my God. The packaging though. Marquez Brownlee is H, the black on black. Tesla logo, Tesla tequila, 100% de agave, hecho in Mexico. I don't know what that means. 750 milliliters, 40% alcohol. What's the other 60%? Elon sweat? Maybe that's why it's so expensive. Okay, here it is. Should I just take it off? Here we go, ready? Go all the way down. Okay, we'll do it again. Dun, 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 dun. I don't know. I don't know if I'm ready. I don't know if I'm ready to just pop it off yet. Like, this is a big moment for me. Sean, just open the box. I, okay, just relax. Just relax. You Calm down. Do, do I want you to do it? Are you crazy? Okay, okay, this is the one. I promise. Why did they wrap everything? Like, it's just open. Like, oh, sorry. Okay, here we go. I feel like I need a punchline now because I've dragged this out so much and I just don't have one. So I feel like I can't even open it anymore. <laughs> next time, subscribe, we'll open it next time. I'm just kidding, I'm just... <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna open it. All right, here we go. Ah! Okay, we got another little logo on the inside here. This bottle was handcrafted by skilled glass artisans. Oh. As such, it has imperfections and markings that make each bottle Unique. That is one of the biggest finesse lines I've ever heard in my life. Yep. Your bottle's <laughs> up, but it's intentional and it's more value because of that. Shut up. No, it's not. My bottle better not be too <laughs> Please take care when handling your bottle of Tesla tequila. Okay, it tells you how to take the top off. To remove the cap, please pull straight up carefully. Do not pull at an angle or sideways. Please enjoy responsibly. Yeah, okay. I'm gonna do this like a matador. Ready? Andare. Ah! <laughs> 
Oh, that's nice. Oh my god. Lightning shape. I didn't know it had a yellow hue to it. I thought the liquid in it was yellow. Let's move this out of the way. Is that right? Come on! That's fire. I'm not gonna lie, I did think it was gonna be bigger. You might be wondering, why is this empty? Uh, you can't ship it with uh, the alcohol in it. I'm not entirely sure why. All of the eBay listings that were selling this all had them empty because of that. On here, government warning. According to the Surgeon General, women should not drink alcoholic beverages during pregnancy. Wow, news to me. Because of the risk of birth defects. Does that have to be on every bottle? Yep. I mean, that is kind of cheesing me. Like, it's pretty big. What did Voldemort run into this thing? Like, like, what is this? I just want to know how bad this tequila smells. One thing I will admit, very disappointed. I was hoping that I was going to be able to taste this tequila. It's definitely not good. I hate tequila. It's disgusting. There's a drop in there. Oh, there is! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it's kind of disgusting, but I, it might be like water. I feel like they might have cleaned it out and that's just water. Only one way to find out. Maybe it's bleach and I'm about to die. Oh, damn! That's some tequila, ladies and gentlemen! Woo-hoo-hoo! Kind of smells nice, though. Not bad, not bad. You guys are going to cringe when you see the cup we're using for this. We've got a little teeny tiny bit, like literally drops. Like we're we're actually drinking drops of tequila right now. <laughs> Cheers to Elon Musk and Tesla tequila. If you make any more, I will buy them for the record. I will take more with the tequila in it as well. It's like tequila water. It's got a, like a light, light hint of tequila, but it's water. I, they definitely poured it out, rinsed it out. Damn it. So I guess unfortunately we can't give you a review as to whether or not the tequila is any good, but this does feel like something's missing. Let's fix that. Okay, folks, it's been a couple days since the uh, LCBO is closed, but we secured the bag, literally. Now we're going to fill up our Tesla tequila bottle with actual tequila. This is where things get interesting. As you guys know me, I'm not much of a planner. And uh, of course, I didn't plan how I'm going to get the tequila from one bottle into the other. And this is a very, very small opening. So this is something we had for a water jug in the past. And uh, we're going to test that out right now and see if it works. Here, you you pour. I'll hold. Oh, 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 God, oh, oh, God, oh, God, oh, God, oh, God, God. oh, God. You're not oh, even pouring. Oh, oh my. <laughs> you got to get it into the thing. Is it good? No, it's oh, not working oh, no. out. Oh, oh my god, oh my god. Oh, oh my god. Damn it! Tequila is the worst thing to spill everywhere because it smells horrible. I'm gonna try and catch this. Oh? Okay. Oh? This is gonna take a really long time, but it's gonna work. Okay, we just have to do that <laughs> 20 more times. Oh shit. This really should come with a funnel, like a Tesla funnel or the Boring Company funnel, but it's themed like the Boring Company tunnel. <laughs> come on, Elon. Yo, that's perfect. And just like that, our Tesla tequila bottle is complete with right. tequila. Come on. It hits a little different when there's actually tequila in the bottle, you know? Like now we're getting the full the full vibes. Jay, would you like a drink? Okay, so you know, pretending I'm a big bouse in my corner office. See how, how the pour is. Oh, some vibe. A little shot. It actually works well. All right, Jay. Here, the Tesla tequila. It's not bad. <laughs> <laughs> really? That's the first shot I've taken in like a year and a half. Well, it wasn't, honestly, it wasn't that bad. For tequila, yeah, normally bad. I need, I need the lemon and the salt it's vibes. Not, it's not strong, to be honest. I made sure to get the 100% the agave. I don't know if it's actually the right one. I know there's some tequila yeah. connoisseurs out there it's watching this cringing. Blue, blue but agave. Either way, not bad, not bad. Kind of a vibe. I'm feeling the Tesla tequila bottle. Definitely gonna hold on to this. I'll probably never have another tequila shot from it, <laughs> but you know, it still looks cool. Come on, this is boss shit. One day I'm gonna be at the top of some penthouse office building, corner office, like I'm in suits. And I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna have some bow CEO come in and I'm gonna say, hey, you wanna, you wanna drink and then I'll be thinking back to me and Jay having a drink out of little coffee cups <laughs> yeah it'll be you know it's a vibe I'm gonna hold on to this I feel like let me know what you guys think or an undisclosed amount of money that I spent on this. Do you think it was worth it? Okay, I'll tell you. So basically for the whole box, it was a thousand, a little over a thousand dollars. I think the short shirts are going for like uh, around 150 to 200 on eBay. I don't know how much this goes for. I have actually no clue. And then this was selling for like 600 to 900 dollars on eBay. So I got it for around that. Plus I got the other items included. Got it all in one little package bundle. And they did say it was going to charity. I don't know what that means. Made me feel better about it so you know but i'd say around 600 bucks it was selling 250 retail with the tequila in it so i spent 600 bucks for just the bottle you know it hurts but let me know do you guys think it was worth it i'm gonna hold on to this forever i feel like it's worth it i feel like this might go up in value imagine elon colonizes mars i have the tesla tequila 
the price of this is going up. This is my Tesla stock. I didn't buy any Tesla stock. This is my Tesla stock. Or you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna do a Tesla mystery box. And on that day, I will buy a Tesla stock. All right, ladies and gentlemen, hopefully I didn't scar you with my shot of me wearing those shorts. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this little Tesla unboxing video. If you guys want to see more Tesla content, there's two more videos right here. As always, thank you so much for watching and we will catch you next time. Toodles.